Hey, I am Three Plus Key, your favorite social worker. I'm here to encourage you to pursue the smile by prioritizing the Lord, your physical health, and persistent education. And today I wanted to talk about failure. So I live in Missoula, Montana. I moved here 20 years ago. Uh, Missoula is a semi-rural mountainous college town. It is picturesque wherever you look, which is exactly why I live here. It's always been a borrow a cup of sugar from your neighbor type town until relatively recently. Um, as you know, the movie Yellowstone <laughs> uh, has been filming production at times in Missoula proper itself. And definitely just down the way in the uh, Bitterroot Valley, that has created an influx of interested people from all over the United States. And the Missoulian way truly is to welcome these individuals, families, groups, so on and so forth. Um, and so with that comes a different type of lifestyle that's infiltrating this small town hometown uh, mentality uh, where there once were late model pickup trucks, Subarus with dogs in them and Missoula keep us weird stickers. Um, there's now Rivian's, Porsches and other luxury vehicles. And again, I think that's great. I think that's great for the economy. Missoula is a welcoming town where a very um connective people community oriented surely so what has kind of come with an influx of people from outside of this specific culture is um money and money to be made by the locals and super fantastic I will say um, there are times when rudeness occurs or a type of impatience with others occurs where maybe there need not be that. And it's um, something that's foreign to this specific culture. And so I noticed today I was kind of thinking about something as I went about um downtown missoula i was interacting with certain people and there was this kind of like standoffishness and and it's downtown right so um that's where a lot of business is conducted so on and so forth and um the thought that occurred to me was wow you know you you have a luxury car and you know you're buying up property and and your clothes look great but as we know the lord commands us to what one love god and number two love others and if you're not doing those two things you're failing <laughs> you're a failure right some people don't even believe in god so in that context your job is still to love others well and in the absence of that you are failing at the the one task of life which is community which we were created to to be in so put another way if people not a person right because it could be contextual if people are consistently walking away from you or your group or your business or what have you they're consistently walking away feeling less than than how they entered your presence you're failing That's it. That's all I wanted to say. Love God. Love others. 
love others very, very well. One thing I say as a social worker is you never know when you're quite literally the only person someone interacts with that day. You don't know what's going on in somebody else's life and why make it worse? I'm not saying you have to go out of your way for a stranger that you don't know and da 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 da. Um, but if people are walking away from you feeling less than, then when they entered your space, you are a failure. I know this might strike a chord. And if it does, a hit dog hollers, doesn't it? Anyway, I'm three plus key, your favorite social worker, always encouraging you to pursue the smile by prioritizing the Lord, your physical health and persistent education. Please subscribe, um, like this video if you love it, share this video with someone who may want to have a conversation about this content and uh, comment below what your thoughts are. And hey, I'll talk to you later.